Hello everybody, it's Alex here, and welcome back for episode number 14 uh, for Hogwarts Legacy. Uh, Alrighty, so in the last one what we did was we started in Hogsmeade. Um, I decided to sell a bunch of things, that uh, gear that was clogging up my inventory, and I made some coins. I didn't buy anything yet because I don't really know what the items are good for. Um, and then I explored a bit more, and I did some fighting, and I came here. Um, and now we're in this little little town thing. I think it's called Upper Hogsfield. Um, and it's supposed to be the continuation of the main quest. But I'm going to talk to see if I can do any side quests quickly first. Excuse me. Did you say something about Bardolf Beaumont? I did. I don't think we've met. I'm Dorothy Sprottle. I was just worrying about Claire Beaumont's brother Bardolf. Only he's gone missing. Rumor is he was seen in the forest practicing dark magic. Saw him myself near some ruins with Rookwood's lot I did. I fear he got himself into trouble with the Ashwinders, especially if he made them a promise he couldn't keep. I'd help search for him myself, but no one will risk encountering Ranrock's loyalists. They seem to be everywhere. Um, I'm just gonna I'm gonna skip all the I extra dialogue. Look out for him. Any help would be appreciated. You might speak to Claire first. Perhaps she has some insights that I don't. I can tell you that Bardolf was last seen in the forest wearing a particular woolen jumper. One that Claire knitted herself. Okay, I wonder if this is going to take a long Claire time. will be at her shop if you'd like to speak with her. Okay, where is that? Over this way? Um, ba -da 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 -da. This could dangerous if I'm not careful. Because I do want to actually get to the main quest. Where are we going? Is this taking me, like, way out of this town? Um... Do I want to do this right now? No, nah, why not? Let's just do it. But, well, this is the only side quest I'll do. I'll do this one, and then definitely I did take a little bit of damage for falling there, I think. Um, definitely we'll do the main quest after I finish this particular side quest, not sorry, other side quest. Uh, or I could start them maybe and not actually do them, and I have them in my like side quest log to remember to go back to later. That's a good idea. Um, I don't know why I chose this one in particular, because this is taking me very far away from where I just was. Can I... Okay, that's one down. Oh, I'm loving this Accio Incendio combo. Too late to learn the error of your ways. Nice. My character's kind of vicious. He just like kills anybody. I'd be in Azkaban so quickly if this was like the forest. real Harry Potter. Right track. Um, I don't really want to. Don't really want to fight that right now, to be honest. Uh, leech juice. Thank you. Oh, there's like a bunch of enemies in here. Ooh, okay. I thought this was going to be like a little village again. Complete the battle in 121. Defeat the enemy with a Chinese chomp. Okay, I'm going to ignore the Chinese chomping cabbage. Oh, and Furious. Okay. Incendio. In the last one, I fought a few of these, but you have to hit them with fire before they take any other damage. So I pretty much have to take them out one at a time. Incendio. Or just however long it takes for Incendio to reset, right? Come on. Okay, good. I can battle this one now, too. Come on, let's go. There's another one behind me, I think. Good. I'm just gonna kill you like this. Bye bye. Oh, there's more. Uh, 
My character just said something about the, the jumper I'm supposed to be finding, but I'm not sure what he said exactly. Oh, I got hit. I had a really good combo going there. I hit again. Oh no. Oh, okay. I gotta really be careful now. Oh, there's even a fourth one. Oh no, I died. Did I die? I didn't die yet. It seems like... So I did the ancient magic on what I guess was the boss. Um, and I got the item, like the, the jumper, I think. I think that's what I just did. But I'm just for the sake of me completion, including this, I want to kill the rest. Okay. I think that's all of them I got now. Cute. Um. I still bet you my level up thing is behind where my face is because I can't see it. Uh. Let's just fast travel back. Okay, let's go and talk to this. Uh, like a place right out of a storybook. Report back to Claire. Oh, I never even talked to her in the first place. Um, I have some news about your brother. Madame Beaumont, I believe I have some news of your brother. Badal, what do you know of my brother? Um, I should tell her he's dead. I regret to say that Bardolf had been turned into an inferior, and. I had to kill him. What? But, but how could you possibly think that an Inferius was my brother Bardolf? That's absurd. He was wearing a woolen jumper, hand knitted. <gasps> no. Oh, this no. is so sad. It can't be. Oh, oh. oh. oh this is. <laughs> I'm truly sorry. I wish it had been better news. I wish you well, Madame Beaumont. This is awful. Oh, oh no, I hated that. Oh. Um. At least I was okay. Let's start this side quest though. Help but over here. Did you mention Ranrock's loyalists? I did. My apologies. I've not been myself since we last met. Oh, she she still remembers the last. Okay. Always have set up camp here. No regard for our beloved hamlet or our livelihoods. Ruthless. It's Ranrock I have to thank for losing Bardolf. If only I could somehow rid our hamlet of these monsters. I'm simply at my wit's end. I feel so bad for this girl. Where have the loyalists set up camp? Have set up camp here. Where, precisely? To the south, across the river. Last I heard, there were several loyalists in each camp. I won't go near them. Um, I could run out. I'm unfortunately quite familiar with Ranrock's loyalists. Perhaps I can do something. <sighs> Much as I would love to be rid of them, I wouldn't want you to risk injury or worse. Please be cautious. Okay, uh, like I said, I'm going to do this another time. Um, I'll start this last side quest too. Best be on my guard. Uh, where's the way in here? Okay. And then I'll find the way to the main quest. Hi. To see you took my advice. Oh, maybe this is the, this is Elder Chigory. Hi. Okay. Helen Thistlewood. Madam Thistlewood, I met your great uncle in his portrait in my common room. He sent me to speak to you. I'm pleased you came. Uncle Eldridge believes the book you found and its missing pages may be relevant to an unsolved case from my time as an aura. Very well. I'm listening. Decades ago, a student named Richard Jackdaw disappeared after going to meet a girl named Anne. They never found his body. When his headless ghost appeared briefly in Hogsmeade, wholly unaware of how he died, Anne was convicted of his murder and sent to Azkaban. It was in large part due to the testimony of a girl called Apollonia Black. Jealous of Anne, I think. That sounds terrible, but I'm not sure how I can help. 
Jane's alibi was somewhat labyrinthine. She said Jackdaw promised her adventure following a map he found on some pages he'd stolen from Peeves. That's really interesting, actually. Peeves ripped those pages from the book I found in the restricted section. If my great uncle is to be believed, yes. At least that's what the portraits at Hogwarts suspect. Anne insisted that Jackdaw had asked her to follow the map with him, but only after she solved a series of puzzles he'd prepared. All the way to woo a girl. She swears she never even solved the first puzzle, so they didn't meet. Jackdaw's ghost vanished almost as soon as he appeared. Without Jackdaw's puzzle, pages, or remains, Anne was sent to Azkaban based solely on Apollonia's spurious testimony. I don't understand. What can I do to help? I believe Anne may have solved the first puzzle by now, but after spending time in Azkaban, she's a shadow of her former self. She won't speak to anyone she doesn't trust, and she trusts no one. If you, a student with a connection to the pages, like Jackdaw had, spoke to Anne, she might reveal new information. Uh, oh, I get to go to Azkaban. For some reason, I was thinking she wasn't in there anymore. If you think I can help, I'll come with you. This is wonderful news. You are to be commended for your kindness and bravery. Fortunately, being a retired aura has its benefits. Oh, cool. We can apparate right to her. Azkaban, this I is so cool. Ministers, professors, and many others to that blasted place. Never a student, I'll admit, but I will keep you safe. I do want to get the additional Can dialogue here. more about Apollonia Black? Wretched, vindictive girl, that one. Apollonia claimed that Anne threatened to kill the boy after he broke her heart. The Black family's power over certain people in the ministry, along with the fact that Anne is muggle-born, sealed her fate. Uh, more about the prisoner? I'd like to know more about Anne. That poor soul never was the brightest girl. And that lack of wit proved to be her undoing. I half suspect Jack Dor and Apollonia were merely toying with her. Who could have known he'd end up dead? She's not held up well in Azkaban. In some ways, she blames me for not proving her innocence. I'd like to clear her name if we can. Uh, okay. You said Jack Dor's ghost appeared briefly, then vanished. Where do you think he went? I have no idea. Evidently, he was always a bit restless, going on and on about adventure. If I had to guess, he tired of Scotland and is somewhere on the other side of the globe by now. Okay, let's go. Cool. Very well. Azkaban! This is so exciting! We'll apparate together. Oh, and I love getting to apparate, too. Splinched anyone. Do take care now, and tread lightly in that horrible place. We'll be there in but a moment. Oh, amazing. Oh, my character's sick. I think. I guess he's not used to apparating. Ooh, Dementors, too. My outfit looks ridiculous. Oh, we love that. Oh, it's a rabbit! Oh, they animated that really well. Keep them at bay for now. Though, be aware, you may feel a wave of despair. It will pass. Thank you for the warning. This really is a dismal place, but we'll be out of here soon enough. Now, follow me. Mind your step. I never thought I'd see the inside of Azkaban for myself. Nasty Dementors. Not even I could convince the Ministry to send them off. There's no need for such monsters. I thought we could. I thought should we could operate like right into her cell or something. Why are we walking around? That's scary. You don't scare me, young cur. They teach you so little of what you should know at Hogwarts. That witch you're with has a dark cloud over her. I can feel it. Oh, I can go like in us. I think it's creepy that like the prisoners are so visible too. Who's there? Uh, are we here? Why torment me further? Okay, Anne. The school's going to believe this. Now remember, Anne has been here a long time. 
The Dementors aren't kind. Have patience and speak to her quietly and respectfully. A Yuan. Okay. Who's there? Who speaks to me? This is this is awful. Is that death? Is that death? Finally come for me. Oh I'm my god. From Hogwarts. With I these ridiculous dragon glasses. Exonerate you. Ah, the book, the book. No one would look. None of the mages found the pages. Methinks the feckless knave meandered to his cave. My fate was surely sealed in Upper Hockey Field. Uh, I think I understand. I don't understand at all. Are you saying that the missing pages are in a cave near Upper Hogsfield? Hogs, Hogs, Field, Field, ruins house, a vault concealed. A vault in some ruins near Upper Hogsfield. I suppose it can't hurt to look. Can't hurt to look. Can't hurt to look. Go find the pages from your book. Helen. Helen. No, you're here. Come in closer. Be a dear. What's she about to do? What is it, Anne? <gasps> what did she do? Did she just kill her? Oh my god, no way. Go. The cave. You're safe now. You have what you need. I'll be all right once I get. Oh no, what happened? Where'd she go? But Madam Thistlewood, I All right. I'll find it. I'll find Jack Dawes cave. Okay. The goblin camp is that part of Oh no, that's the side quest. Um, let me check how far into this I am. Okay. So I have about like 10, 15 minutes. Um, Prisoner of Love. Their cave just outside of Hogsfield. She mentioned a knave meandering to a cave. Okay. Um, it is going to tell me exactly where to go again, but that's okay. I think I'm just going to accept the fact that once I'm, when I'm doing quests, the game is just going to tell me where to go. Not um, sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. It seems as though things are getting worse. Sure, I'll tip the guy. It was probably a waste of coins, but whatever. Um, but what I was saying is it's like when I'm not doing quests and I'm out just like exploring. Oh, what's happening? Okay. Forest Ivy Scarf. That is an upgrade on mine, right? Um, when I'm out just exploring on my own, I'm not going to have to worry so much about, uh, like that being on the mini map because I'm not going to be following any sort of quest, right? Um, it seems like I have an upgrade. Oh, it's locked. Oh, I need to be level 14 before I can wear this. Interesting. I guess my character's only level 13 right now. So, okay, so some gear does have, like, level rec restrictions on it. I'm gonna fall into here. I'm literally just following the, like, yellow thing there. Because the cave must be below me. Um... Can I just fall down? Oh, I didn't mean to, like, fully fall down, but that's okay. That works for me. And we're still above the cave, eh? Um, oh, now why am I going over here? Why did I tell me to go here first? It doesn't make sense. Oh, Oops, I don't need this. There we go. That to be on the screen anymore. Okay. Um... I gotta go this way. Where's the trail? Okay, here it is. This direction. Here's the cave. Okay. Ooh, I'm actually in the Forbidden Forest. I can see it by my thing. Okay, cool. Um, This must be the place Anne told me about. 
Okay, well, what's in here? No one's been here for ages. Lumos. I like that my character just has, like, a flashlight always on him, and I can use it whenever I want. Ooh, what's this? Accio. It's no wonder I never found that clue. What am I supposed to do? Okay, what does it say in the quest description? She mentioned a knave meandering to a cave. Revelio. Oops. Is there some sort of pattern to how they're supposed to be pulled? You're not out Fox. Did I really just do that right? Okay. I don't know what I did. No. Nope. And then this one? Is it just the same pattern but opposite? Okay, I completely guessed you this. Now with me, Jackdaw. Now where's the clue you left behind? Um I completely guessed that. I don't know if there was a proper way to do this. I've decided I want to start actually reading these note things like in the like British accent. Um if it gets annoying, tell me, but um so <clears throat> my dearest Anne. Well done, you solved my puzzle. I knew you were a kindred spirit and the only one with whom I could truly share my adventures. I'm not having a good time with this accent today. I need to stop it immediately and I'm going to keep going anyway because I don't care. Um, meet me at the edge of the wooden forest as soon as you can and I will show you the, the map I mentioned. There is no telling where it will lead us. I found it on pages that Peeves ripped from a secret book uh, and no one else seemed to be able to find. I haven't any idea what lies ahead, but I'm glad to know I shall share my future with you. This is only the beginning, Richard. P.S. I am terribly glad you found this, as I would have gone on alone uh, if you did not. And what fun would that be? Um, a note from Jackdaw. Anne never found it. So how did he die? Was she to blame at all? Can we not? Let's not mention how terrible, terrible that accent was. <laughs> but I had fun doing it anyway. I should investigate. Okay, where are we going now? Leave the vault. Could it be? Oh, hi. Has someone solved my puzzle after all these years? Well done, indeed. No, he's not very old. Richard Jackdaw, at your service. The Richard Jackdaw. I heard you disappeared years ago. You have some explaining to do. I do? That was my puzzle you solved. What are you doing here? I just guessed. A retired aura, Helen Thistlewood, told me about a map you stole from Peeves. And then Anne told me about a cave. You saw Anne? Broke my heart. I had to go on without her. Probably best for her in the end. Dare no. I ask? How is she? Oh, he doesn't even know. I'm just gonna say not well. She was imprisoned in Azkaban for your murder. I fear the Dementors have taken an irreversible toll on her. What? Azkaban? Oh, poor Anne. I had no idea. I thought she'd written me off. I've been traveling the world for years to mend my broken heart. I came back here only recently. On a whim. I must speak to the aura you mentioned and see how I can help Okay, her. but I don't know how she is. Hear it. Before you go... Would I still be able to find the pages with the map Helen mentioned? I'm almost certain I dropped them in the cave the moment I was beheaded. They're bound to be mouldering away with the rest of me. Tell you what, meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll show you precisely where to find them. Okay, uh, how did you lose your head? I want to read these two. If you don't mind me asking, how did you lose your head? I was having a look about when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze. After which I felt, well, light-headed. That's all I remember. Hence, if you do find yourself in a cave, be prepared. I can't tell you what for specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Beware a light breeze. Imagine being beheaded and Helen, just being so casual about it in life. the afterlife later. Did she set up Anne to take the fall? Have you never met any members of the Black family? They can be rather vindictive. 
Once Anne showed an interest in me, Apollonia couldn't let it alone. That her own heart had grown cold simply didn't matter. Okay. How is it possible to steal from Peeves? A poltergeist. I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of destruction. He has a penchant for wrecking things. Books, bottles, suits of armor. Whatever's likely to cause the most chaos. Found them on the floor outside the library where he discarded them. Not my luck. So he didn't really steal them. Considered. He just kind of found them. Thank you. Thank you. I need to find those pages to help a friend. I shall see you there. Okay, so where are we going? Oh, that's the end of this main quest. Um, but it seems like there should be more of it. Where am I going? Let's go to my quests. Use the map for trees of fire. Oh, this is the map that I picked up. Can I look at, how do I use the map? I don't know. Um, I guess there aren't any main quests right now. Is it going to show up in a minute? Oh, new quest available. This is where I'm going. Head to the Fitten Forest. Jackdaw's Rest. Uh, track this quest. Well, no, I'm not going to track this quest because I don't want the little dots to be on minimap. I'm just going to follow that little block on minimap. And I think we're going to do that next time because how long has it been? It's been almost half an hour. Um, why don't we go do actually that other side quest? And maybe we can do it in like five minutes. Um, where is it? Ghosts, no, not that one. Is it breaking camp? Clear the goblin encampments. Just level two. Okay, I don't think this will take me too long. Um, let's do this quickly. Three hundred away. Why did I keep going so far from where I need to be? Actually, I bet you I could fast travel into the town and get there quickly enough. Uh, into Upper Hogsfield. Yeah, because they're on the other side of this town. Okay. I'm still, like, quite a bit far. Like, not that close to where I'm going. Uh, I still really am tempted to play with the minimap off. Like, I'm trying to think of what I'm... Because I do kind of use it for a point of reference when I'm walking around normally. Um, just to, like, observe... The paths and everything, but I, 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 I really don't like that it just tells me exactly where to go all the time. I know I keep mentioning that. Oh, I don't have Expelliarmus in here. I need to change that. There we go. Oh, I hit me. Oh, Incendio's range is so bad. Ow. Oh, that hit both of them, though. The Incendio. That's cool. Oh, there's more. Oh, I meant to do that on the other one, but that's okay. How many, of these, how many of these people are there? Or goblins, I guess. Ow. There we go. Did I get them all? You've one less follower, Ranrock. One camp down. Okay, good, 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 good. I was like, I'm about to die. <laughs> um, It's funny, like, these evil whatever, and, like, there's just a regular path here with somebody walking. Like, are they going to just attack these people? Um, 
Also, it's nighttime now. It's making it more difficult to see. I'm for a bit of dying, are we? I'm famished. All right. Accio. Oh, Accio and Sendio are my favorite combo ever. I will make you pay. Ow, I didn't even see that guy next to me. Uh, did he hit me? Oh, I guess he did. Goodbye. Heh. <laughs> oh no, there's a bunch of them now. Alright. Move. There we go, I got one. Move. Move! Okay, good. Uh, we're getting a lot better at this. At this, The dodging and everything. This was actually trickier than I expected it to be, though. Oh, he hit me a couple times, I think. There's still one behind me. Where's this last guy? Goodbye! <laughs> oh, that's so brutal. I think we won. Both camps cleared. Alan Beaumont will be glad to hear that. Okay. And then let's fast travel back here. Your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Hmm. Seems a pleasant enough little place. Okay. Hello, Claire. I should have done more. Hello, Madam Beaumont. Good news. I was able to clear out Ranrock's camps. You cleared them out? How? Um, I just surprised I them. Catch them off guard. I'm just oh, excellent at spells. Done what you did. Perhaps you'd still be with me now. I'm especially grateful. You did for Bardolf what I could not. You saved our hamlet, my young friend. This will not be forgotten. I fear for other hamlets, truly. Ranrock and his lot are unlike any goblins I've ever seen. Uh, may I? Oh, uh, sure. Let's see what she has to sell. What are you looking for exactly? Thank you, sincerely. Okay. I should have done more. I shall never forgive myself. So I get these from killing in Fury. I get these from killing the mongrels. Okay, I don't need to buy anything from you. Is there anything I can sell? I upgraded this, right? Two hundred. Beautiful. I could always use more of these. Um. Okay. That's going to be good for now. So yeah, we'll go figure out where, where the go that uh, the ghost I was talking to. Um, we'll go figure out where he is in the next one. And these daffodils are loud again. Um, but yeah, for now, I'm going to end this one here. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. And we will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.